what is up YouTube? Keg Leg back at it again with episode 4 of the Boston Bruins GM series. Uh, last episode we played the Philadelphia Flyers on a Wednesday night rivalry game at the Garden. Um, Chara probably had the game of his life. He got a hat trick. A uh, pretty cheap hat trick, but you know, empty netters count, right? We got the title, I'm joking. Um... But, uh, yeah, uh, last episode we also did a few games that were simmed. Um, we simmed this game, this game, and this game. And we won the Philadelphia game 5, oh, I don't know, 3-1. And in this episode, we will be playing the New York Islanders. So, um, as for trades in this series... I'm kind of wondering what we should do about that. Um, actually, I might start scouting a few players. Uh, I'm not very good with the whole, uh, you know, actual part of the GM mode stuff. But we're gonna we're gonna try it. Uh, we'll do the U.S. Uh, yeah, we'll do forwards for three weeks. Okay. And as for the lines go, I'm actually going to change them based on how well the players are doing, actually, in this episode to start off. So who's our point leader? Rick Nash is our point leader. Okay, so let's see here. Let's check forwards out. Um, Krejci. Doing good. Bacchus. Uh, Bergeron killing it. Donato killing it. Um, Krejci, as I said, doing a good job. Rick Nash killing it. Pasternak. Uh, he's kind of kind of on a low. Um, I'm probably not going to switch him out for Nash on the first line. Just because I'd like for him to grow. Um, Schaller doing pretty good. Okay. So let's see how the lines are doing. Uh, Rick Nash is basically the standout for me right now. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, but, um, we'll do something about that. Uh, I'm really liking this pairing of lines. Um, I might have Donato playing, like, Pasternak spot maybe later in the season. I don't know if he still is kind of chilly. I might. I might. Also might be trading David back. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Um, I've hear, I've heard that Krug is absolutely going off right now. Um, he's a lefty, so he would fit that Charlie McAvoy spot. But, I think Carlo's a good fit. Um, actually, you know what? I'm going to switch him with that. So, we'll do that. Uh, is he righty? I want Mac. Oh, wait, no. Okay. Right and right. Okay. Good, good, good. So, now we're going to go to the offense again. Uh, Schaller, that's a good line. I'm really thinking about making a trade, actually, right now. Let's see. Okay, because I'd like a kind of new winger, I guess. Uh, we'll just go through all the teams, see what they have uh, for forwards. Gatslav. Raquel. I hear that he's alright. He, How old is he? Uh, doesn't say. I might... Uh, I don't know. Okay. Let's see. Who else is there? I could go for an Oliver Ekman Larson type guy. Um. Oh yeah. Okay, so he's injured right now, but he is 
He's a good defenseman. Okay, so Larson, that Raquel dude. Um, Ristolainen, that's another one. Cody Franzen. Okay. Uh, just trying to quickly think. I could get like a guy like Johnny Goudreau um, if he is on the team. Is he a left winger? Yeah, he is. Okay. Wow, he's injured as well. That's no, that's good. That I could get a Panarin. Ooh, Panarin, not that bad. Okay, I'm I'm looking at Panarin right now. You know what? We're gonna trade for Panarin because I hear that he's pretty good in this game or in NHL 18 at least. So we're gonna see what we can trade. Vitrano's not on the Bruins. Um. Let's see who else we have. Oh, I'm looking at... Okay. Okay, I'm not very good at this whole trading thing, as you can see. Donato? No. Stafford? I don't know why I still have you in the team. But... Ooh. Why are we... Why are we lagging here? I, I told you to get rid of him. Okay. Well... <laughs> You know what, I really shouldn't be trading Drew Stafford because I he's a created player, so technically it's a bit cheating. Um who do we, who are we willing to lose? That has a realistic trade value because I'm aware that this is very bad in this category. I guess we'll chase this guy. Um we'll see what they think. Um move down. Okay, yeah, no, I'll call him back up. Okay, cool, cool. So we're going to call Shallow back up, and we're going to welcome Mr. Artemi Panarin, I think his name is. So call Timmy Shallow up. Nope, not possible. Chill, chill. No, we're good, we're good. Okay, okay. Wow, our team is stacked right now. Jeez. Okay, I don't want you in here. Okay, Drew Stafford, back down in the NHL. No one likes you. Okay, cool. All right, Tim Schaller. Uh, so we're going to have to edit those lines to see where Panarin's going to be in. sure let's see here um I could put him in uh, I don't know I have no idea actually okay we'll send Schaller back down to the AHL and we'll put Panarin right there okay you know what it's not that bad actually the, um, we'll keep Schaller in the NHL, but we'll just, okay, so this is going to be a very offensive-minded, um, penalty kill here, but, you know, that's fine. Okay, so into the game, uh, do we want to play the Islanders in this? Probably not. Uh, let me see who's doing good right now. Okay, and we are back. After some indecisive simming, we have decided to play the New York Rangers at home after fixing up the lines, making a trade. Okay, we we did it, so we're, we're cool. Okay, so we're going to finally start this game. I'd say we simmed probably... Uh, 15 games at most. Hopefully we'll get a dub. But our Temi Panarin. Three, two, one, go! Yes. What a shot. Nice. That was really good.
Alrighty, that was that was that was really good. I'm um, two on one there. Good play by um who was that? Actually I think DeBrus got the assist, that's why I was confused. Going to the second period. We're up one nothing. We're doing really well. Rask just stood on his head for a little bit then, so that was that was good. That was dangerous. Good save. Rask has been absolutely insane <clears throat> in this series so far. Um, in the Philly game, literally, I think. Oh, okay. As I talk good about Rask. Hmm. Oh, that's not interesting. I don't like that. Can you stop that, please, Broussard? I don't enjoy your presence here in the hockey room. Oh, let's go. What a response. Good. Wicked shot there by Bergeron. Great response. I was going to say, feel free to leave the ice, Broussard, even though I don't. That's not good. What is that? Like, honestly, I'm just saying, what is that? That is a vile occurrence. That is a vile sight. My eyes have been assaulted with a deadly weapon that is your presence. Anyways, Ross continuing to stand on his head for two games in a row that we have played. Not that, you know. Okay. Anyways, third period coming up. We are down by a goal going into the third. We kind of need some offensive output, maybe from Panarin, our new signing. I know you're not in the same. Yes! Support the play! Just poke it until it goes in. Yes, Riley Nash. Okay, he's got a two gold game. That is awesome. But that didn't work. Oh, McQuaid, I don't like you. It's off. We got the first line out there. Bergeron, come on. No. Why do I stink at face-offs? All right, glass, shatter. <laughs> oh, my gosh. You could have killed him. What are you doing? All right, just don't let him score again. Shoot. Okay, we lost. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, well... That's going to be the end of the episode. Um, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like and don't forget to subscribe. And uh, happy Easter. And uh, yeah, hopefully in the next episode we'll win. So uh, see ya. Bye. <laughs>